Like that, guys, this is no way to build airplanes. Okay, if an airplane is built on this, I'm not flying on that airplane, guys. Okay. And I strongly recommend that you don't either. Okay. Now, again, I'm not saying that language models, transformers, and stochastic systems aren't cool. They are incredibly cool. I freaking love them. I love them for rapid prototyping. I love them for creative ideation. I love them for stuff like that. What I don't love them for is hard science. When I need the answer to be correct, and I need to know that it actually is telling me things that are going to be reliable. And this is part of the reason why we have Merli, is that Merli is designed to actually improve the fidelity of things that you know, it, it it takes us longer because we have to actually invent all the technology and build it from scratch. Um, but we're getting there, right? So the the part that's I think quite interesting about this this first example that it gave here this is wrong, but the second example it gave was right. Yeah, yeah, correct is just the best vibe, right? It's like uh three plus seven like yeah it's nine or it's 12 it's like nine feels right like both of those are wrong but it's like yeah man like close enough right like don't if if you have vibe coders at the banking institution that you work with like switch banks guys just no or or the hospital that you like if they start using language models as like their their uh for patient inpatient form so it was just time to find a new medical doctor that being said if you want to do like a chatbot that's going to argue with you about stuff like this right and what's really amusing is at one point when i first started using that i'd be like okay i'm gonna be the guy that's gonna argue with you and i'm gonna explain to you why this is wrong and so i would I would be like, no, you're wrong. And then I would explain it to them. And then it'd be like, no, you're wrong. I'd be like, do the logic. And then I would finally convince it. At, you know, mostly I think it's just trained to eventually agree. Like, I don't think it actually knew that it was wrong. Um, and keep in mind, I'm not, I'm not the guy that is going to argue with the AI when I know I'm wrong, just to see if it will switch to the wrong answer. I know some people are doing that, but I would do it because I would try to help the AI. And then I realized this is total, <laughs> you know, like I am a missionary. Like this is why, like, for example, <laughs> Taylor and I have the board meeting tomorrow. I should probably be doing board related stuff, but yeah, 